can I help you find something? Uh, <clears throat> actually, um, uh, do you know someone named Amelia? Why? Because I think she sent me to find you. What did I think about Helena? I, I don't know. I, I, I really loved. It's like a simple, complex nature, right? So it's like a lot of us. It's what we show to the world and who we really are inside. And oftentimes they're so melded together that you think you're being yourself or really you're maybe, you have a couple of protective layers to make sure nobody gets too close. And um, I could identify with that sometimes. You know, she's, she's silly, she's fun, um, but she definitely was holding on to some pain and you could see it seep through and, you know. You have an idea where she might be? I don't know. I mean, I know she's been doing a lot of traveling and, and. Oh my God, are you, is there something I said? I'm sorry, I didn't. With film, especially one like this one, you're able to hold on, you're able to really explore your character, what she's going through, the relationships uh, that your character has with everybody else in the film, and that's really fun for me, and that's uh, something that you can sink your teeth in a little bit more. And also, you can let things breathe more. I can take the moments, I can really sit, and then um, I can, whenever I get called to feel, speak, react, it can happen a little bit more organically than, you know, TV, you have to be, uh, you have to honor the time a bit more. Something happening here? Kind of. You're sitting on the drawers I need to go through. Oh, sorry. You know, it's funny, the older that I've gotten, the more I am able to access parts of me that I didn't have the access for when I was younger. And I'm really loving that. It could be I'm letting my guard down more, I'm uh, more vulnerable, more open, and I'm a bit of a natural empath, so I feel like when I see somebody hurting or when, I'm, uh, when I see somebody in pain or happiness, I, it's easy for me to kind of hold on, grab that emotion for myself almost if, as if I'm going through it as well. So I love when I'm reading this, like talking about um, Amelia. I just saw Sarah's face and I, <laughs> and, and again, I don't have a sister, but I really felt, what is she going through? I don't want to give anything away, but I, I, like, I like seeing that in, in people and seeing their vulnerability and their ability to be be themselves when, you know, when they have to kind of crack open that mask. It's always interesting for me to see that.